If you're here in the Cleveland market and you're thinking about making the jump into the Airbnb business, because they've got a lot of stuff in Northeast Ohio to offer, right? A lot of people don't think of us as a vacation destination, but in reality we are. So if you're trying to do that, but you don't want to deal with the the day-to-day -day stuff or you're just trying to learn how to work the day-to-day -day stuff, I got something for you right now. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the show. I am James Wise. This is where we talk Cleveland real estate, right? So if you've never heard of Holden Wise TV before, I assure you, you're going to want to subscribe if you're interested in Cleveland real estate. Because we are the premier place <clears throat> for Cleveland real estate. Now, today I'm working with a man named Eric. Eric is from the Cleveland area, and Eric has a high-profile job. He's a high-profile attorney, okay? So what that means is Eric's a busy dude, okay? Eric's busy. You know what Eric can't do? Well, he could do it, but it'd be stupid. He can't clean a toilet after somebody vacationed in his house. He can't stock uh, sugar packets. He can't fill coffee, right? That would be him losing a whole bunch of money, right? Because he makes a lot of money with his high-profile job, okay? So he wants to invest in Airbnb rentals, but he wants to do so passively so he can do what he does best and let my team do what we do best, and that's manage his Airbnb rentals. And what I got for you today, Eric, I got one out in Vermillion. Yeah, we're talking very close to Cedar Point, very close to Putin Bay, very close to Kelly's Island, right there on the lake. And guess what, brother? It's brand new construction, and it's going to take less than 70 grand out of your pocket. Let's jump into the numbers right now. Hey, Steve. What are you doing? Oh, nothing. Just saving money on my rental property insurance. Oh, my, Steve. Take me now. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy. Wow, I'm so glad I clicked that link below. Welcome back. We're going to pull up the property now, folks. Getting a vacation rental, brand spanking new construction by the islands, by one of the largest amusement parks in the country. <clears throat> and we're only going to have to spend about 100 Grand. Honestly, you can get away with only spending like 68 grand out of your pocket, okay? Yeah, that's crazy, right? But that's what we're doing. We're talking about the Northeast Ohio real estate market, right? The Cleveland real estate market, right? It's probably what a lot of you uh, are used to hearing, right? Cleveland, 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 Cleveland. Well, this property's not in Cleveland. It's about 45 minutes west of Cleveland, okay? But on a national scale, when people are talking about Northeast Ohio, everybody usually says the Cleveland, the Cleveland market, right? You got the Indians, the Browns, uh, well, not the Indians, they're the Guardians now, depending on how woke you are. And then we got the Cavs, right? Cavs are doing good. We got all them seven-footers kicking booty, right? Okay? So everyone thinks it's Cleveland, but, the, you know, very big, very big metro area, right? The city of Cleveland, <coughs> it's like 350,000 uh, residents, something like that, right? The metro area that we operate in, the whole Wise operates in, we're talking like three, four million people, okay? So you go really far west to a little city called Vermilion. And Vermilion is a nice little vacation area, right? And it's got some very, very big draws to it, right? It's got a little something called Cedar Point, one of the largest amusement parks in America, right? In addition, it's got Lake Erie, one of the five largest freshwater lakes in the country, right? In Lake Erie, we have two very popular islands, Kelly's Island and Putin Bay. All the partiers go out there, right? Party it up. Putin Bay, honestly, it's it's kind of like uh it's like a Mardi Gras vibe, okay? I spent many a nights totally hammed out of my mind in my early 20s on Putin Bay, okay? Not so much uh these days, got a bunch of kids and whatnot, and, you know, it's just my liver's just too old for that, okay? But uh, Putin Bay is a very, very nice place, and Kelly's Island's a little more family-friendly, okay? 
It's kind of more my speed now. A little more family friendly, a little less Mardi Gras, but all of which has a huge draw, right? Huge draw, okay? And here's the cool thing. <clears throat> because we're in an area like this where the cost of living is so low, you guys can pick up brand <laughs> new construction. This deal, I love this deal. I love this development because it's got something that most developments around here don't have, okay? It's 6030 Conneaut Light, Vermilion, Ohio, uh, 284,537. This was like a model home, so it says it's been on the market forever. But it was kind of one of those things where the builder had put it out there and then people would reach out and then they'd be like, oh, well, we'll customize this house for you or we'll customize that one. So they're, like, they're moving. Don't think it's just sitting on the market, right? Brand new home, okay, in a brand new development, right? But here's the thing. Here's the, the layout, right? Because, again, they were using this to sell, like, the re you know, they were trying to sell out their uh, development, okay? Look at this. All fresh, all beautiful, all brand new, right? But here's the thing, right? If you're going to get in the short-term rental game, you're getting an Airbnb, Verbo, all that jazz, right? What you got to understand is the biggest drawback. Here's some other photos from, like, other homes they've done, right? Uh, the biggest drawback to nice new construction homes like this is the dreaded HOA, man. The HOA is our enemy. Okay, we don't like HOAs if we're doing short-term rentals, folks, because HOAs often <clears throat> restrict how you can utilize your property, and temporary rentals are one of those restrictions. But guess what? That's why I love this new development so much. No HOA. It is almost unheard of to get a brand new development like this with no HOA. And this thing is located in a primo spot, right? Here's the whole development, okay? Look at all these lots, all these new homes getting slapped in there. Still building it out, building this whole thing. And look at this, zooming out. Oh, that's why it's such a beautiful vacation area. Yeah, look at that beautiful lake right there, folks. This is where it's all at, right? So to the east... You got Cleveland, all that stuff. Downtown Cleveland, all the sports teams, the casino. To the west, we got Cedar Point. To the north, we got the islands, right? So we're going to get a huge draw. House is beautiful. House is nice. Don't need to worry about any issues with, like, deferred maintenance, any of this, right? You're getting brand new construction. But none of that should matter if it doesn't make money, right? You're all here to make money. So what do the numbers look like? Well, it's a four bed, a three bath, and we should be able to rent it for three seventy five a night. If we did that every night, we'd be bringing in almost $140,000 a year in rent. But don't get crazy, folks. <clears throat> Who in their right mind actually believes you're going to rent a short-term rental, however nice it is, however cool the location is, every night of the year? You won't. It's not going to happen, okay? Duh. Now, a realistic expectation of performance would be uh, renting at about 60 62% of the time. Then you factor in your cleaning fees, taxes, insurance, lawn care, paying Holton Wise to handle the investment for you because it doesn't matter where you live, folks. Holton Wise does the whole thing. That's why we get investors from Florida, investors from California, investors from New York, right? They all come to this market because they're looking for a cheaper cost of living. They are looking to be in areas where the landlord-tenant laws are fair, right? You want your landlord-tenant laws and rights to be like this, okay? You take places like New York, it's like, woo, tenants. You take places like Portland, tenants. Places like California, tenants, right? They're legislating out your ability to run your real estate empire, folks. You guys, and I shouldn't even say real estate empire. To be honest with you, the majority of you that are buying these properties, you're just normal, regular, hardworking Americans, right? Working hard at your job, saving up your money, and just trying to create a little bit better uh, <clears throat> legacy wealth in retirement for yourself, your family, right? That's what it is. All the vilification of landlords in those crazy markets like that is just out of control. So a lot of you guys come here. So the whole thing's passive. So, of course, in this performance chart, I have the fee you'll be paying us to handle the investment. So in reality, yeah, if you were doing it every day and there weren't any costs, it'd be like 140 k But we should really be a little bit above 50 right? A little bit above 50 for the year. Now, what's that going to look like? Well, they're asking 284 537 I think we could probably pick it up for 275 we do so, you're putting down 68750 
We'll get the bank to kick in 206. Now, you're going to need about 35 grand to get this thing furnished. Don't worry, Holton Wise will handle all of that. I'm talking furnished, decorated, everything. We've thought of it all, we've got it all. We will go in there, build the couches, put the couches up, put the floor mats down. Stock the kitchen. Make sure we got some coffee makers in there. Hook up the Wi-Fi so people can watch their Hulu and their Netflix and their this or that. We'll get you an entire itemized list that breaks everything down, right? We got an itemized list for your toilet paper, for your toilet brush, right? For sippy cups for the kids, right? Hello? We're talking Cedar Point. They're going to be kids, you know? Stuff that you guys probably haven't thought of. Holton Weiss, we thought of it all. Over $200 million in sales in this market, all to investors like you, right? So the total investment should be about 310000 About 103000 should be up for up cost, right? And that's going to be 68750 for the mortgage and then thirty-five k for all the furnishings and the fix-ins to get this thing going. Now, don't worry. You're not like having a shop on Amazon and buy it all. We do it all. So you actually just pay us with credit cards. So in reality, you don't need that up front either. You put that stuff on a credit card, maybe do one of those 12-month no-interest cards. However you want to handle it, that's fine. We'll put the whole thing on a card for you. So you really only need about 68. But assuming you paid cash for everything, you're all in upfront investments, about 103750 right? So after you pay off your mortgage, that should kick off approximately a 36% return on your investment if things go according to plan. And you get a very nice, brand-new construction home dealing with tenants, uh, I shouldn't say tenants, you're dealing with guests that are of higher income and can afford the nicer things, the luxury stuff. So you're not dealing with like the toilets and trouble and evictions and all that jazz you guys see on our evictions, uh, <coughs> our live eviction videos on the Tennis from Hell show, right? So should be a smooth operation and I really dig this stuff and I just dig all the atmosphere that we got out there. And it's crazy to think that Northeast Ohio would be a tourist destination and uh, we are, right? Nobody thinks we are, but we are, right? Uh, it's not Miami, though, right? It's not Miami. It's not L.A. But but you're not paying Miami or L.A. pricing, right? That's why you're able to pick this thing up for about 68 grand out of your pocket. Let's go. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.